Taylor Tizen Talks. Now, we're talking about this in my update video. Uh, we're going to talk about a little bit more here. So, yeah, so today we're going to talk about mean comments. Now, we're all in that day and age where TikTok is around, where Instagram is around, where Facebook is around, where YouTube is around. We all live in a very uh, internet -y world, basically. And, yes, um... You know, like, it's, uh, it's interesting times. Like, you know, like, um, yeah, like, the internet has sort of, not, I wouldn't say corrupt people, but the internet, you know, sometimes the internet's good and bad, like I said in my last previous autism talks as well. So, yeah, so, um, you know, so today we're going to talk about that. Now, previously I talked about my update videos, how I've been getting some mean comments on my channel, which I do not appreciate it. Nope, I... I, you know, I said in my Snow White trailer reaction and I said it in my a couple of update videos as well. I had to, you know, I had to say goodbye to, um, I didn't, not say goodbye, but I decided to log off, uh, TikTok because for that particular reason, because I put a comment out there, it was very positive and people just tried to twist it and turn and I'm like, well, I didn't, I didn't say that. So I think the reason why I was on TikTok in the first place because some of my friends are on TikTok. So I think that's why I was. But I'm not on TikTok. I'm not on TikTok. I will never go on TikTok, TikTok again. I'm so sorry if you are on TikTok. I'm sorry if I'm not on TikTok. But it's 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 for the best. It's for my mental well-being and for my health, basically. So, yeah. So, I hope you guys understand that. So, yeah. So, you know, gaming comments isn't the greatest. Um, You're like, Miller, what do you do in a situation when that happens? Well, <laughs> I had to learn that... um. Oh, sorry, that's my phone. Now, I had to learn that um, there are two things you can do, all right? So, number one is don't start a fight on uh, social media. That's what I've learned. That's what I had to learn to do because people were just coming at me and at me and at me. I'm like, you know, like they never stop. Like they never stop harassing you. Not harassing you, but you get what I mean. That, that, that they never stop. And if you get involved, it depends what person it is, first off. It, it depends what person it was. If it's just one, like one comment, then it's fine. But if it's like a hundred comments later, and I'm like, oh, I'm, I'm out. I'm, I'm, I'm tapping out of this. I'm tapping out of this. Like a sports event, basically. So, yeah. So, me comments are tough. I've experienced a couple on YouTube. Like, it's weird. Like... You know, usually like on YouTube, you know, uh, some mean comments affect the channel. I'm not sure if you've seen them popping around the place. But, um, it usually really affects the channel sometimes. It's surprising to me that it hasn't affected the channel as much. But it's affected me more as a person. And I'm like, why is... I, I don't understand. It's so confusing. But my channel is very safe. And I try to, you know, not bring drama to it as well. Like, I'm not really a person that gets into drama. I hate drama, by the way. I, I hate gossip as well. So, you know. So, yeah. But, you know, me and comments are just... You know, like, you know, the word for that is keyboard warriors. You know, they're just behind a keyboard, make it, they're probably sad about their life. They probably, you know, hate their life and have nothing else to do but bug you, basically. So that's what I'm trying to get at. So if someone, you know, is, you know, um, doing that to you, then um, you have to do something about that. Like, with me, I'm like, if someone's being mean to me, like, I have to either block them or um, tell them, say, don't, don't, you know, don't do that to my channel. Like, I don't, like, I don't, I don't, um, I don't need this on my channel. So, it's hard. Um, you know, so, yeah, it's hard. Like, I think being on YouTube has made me realize, like, oh, I'm getting some really good comments off people, but I'm getting some bad ones. Not often, which is good. Not often. So, they're not, like, harassing me or anything, which I would not do. But, yeah, but, um... You know, like, I, you know, there's been a couple of people that I've had to block because of that reason and they were being mean to me and, you know, not harassing me but being very mean to me and I had to do the right thing and the responsible thing to block them and that's what you can do. And also, there's, like, an option on Instagram. It's probably an option on, I don't know about TikTok, but there's an option for if you're getting, you know, if you don't like a comment, you can either, you know, block it or delete it. Now, my suggestion to you guys is block it because you don't get that from that other account. You don't want any, you know, you don't want any of those comments coming to you. So my, so my, so my advice to you guys is to block them or to, um, you know, delete the comment um, as well. So you could do that. There's, there's all sorts of things. Like if you don't like, if you've 
Like, never go too far on uh, social media. That's what I had to learn to do. So never do that. But you can do things to, you know, protect yourself. And that's what I had to do. Because, you know, I don't want people, you know, I don't want mean people coming after me just because I said something. And I, and I say something that's really positive and they kind of spin it and turn it. So it's like, what I do? So there's always options. There's every option you can do to do that. Because I know sometimes mean comments kind of, you know, um get to you mentally like i remember this one time like this person said something very mean to me and i was crying because i'm like why would they say that like you know why would they say that like you know and i kind of you know had to say to myself there just keyboard warriors behind a keyboard you know complaining about their life so you've got to think it like that basically that's what i try to get at you have to think it like that um, you know, think it like that. That sounds like a song. <laughs> anyway, me rambling on. But you gotta think, you gotta think like that. You know, plus they're on the other side of the world. They're not gonna, you know, do something to you, basically. Like, they're not gonna come bashing down your door or anything. No, no, there's options to block or delete or report to, um, YouTube. I've reported a couple of times to YouTube. I'm not telling you my reasons because it's none of you guys' business, but I've reported some people um for that particular reason oh my god that live stream oh my god that was awful like why i haven't i haven't a live stream conversation with my viewers and you just keep typing in and i'm like oh my god so yeah so yeah i had to I had to report i had to you know ask you two about that because i'm like you can't do that on a real live live stream i see people do live streams and they never get anything like that so it's like why is this happening to me but yeah but um you know, some people can just be really mean. And, you know, there's always options to do those things. Like I said, have a block or delete or, you know, if you want to report them, you can. So there's, re so there's you know, options to have if you've been, not attacked, but if you've been like, you know, someone's just being mean to you and saying, you know, bad things about you, then you got to do something about that. Like, don't leave it. Don't leave it. Like, I had to learn, like, you know, um, to block and stuff like that and, you know, do all of that because, you know, you don't want that to affect your channel or you don't want to affect, you don't want any, anything to, you don't want anything to affect you. So if you want my advice, do it straight away. You know, you get it over and done with and you just go, oh, I've done it. I've done it. I've blocked that person. You know, it's not going to hurt me. So just do that because it's the best thing for you. And plus, being on YouTube for so long now, I can't believe I'm up to 11k thousand. But, um, you know, but, you know, just goes to show you there are going to be haters. And, you know, depending on what the haters will be. And I always say to them, don't click on it or don't watch it. So that's what I usually do when it comes to that. I'm not sure if you see my comments on that. But I say to people, if you don't like something, don't comment. It's that simple. But they just want to comment. I'm like, you have a choice. You are a person. If you have a comment or swipe, I don't care if people swipe on my videos. I don't care. But it's bad enough that they make a, it's bad enough that they, um, you know, comment on something that I've worked on so hard and they just completely trash it. And I'm like, you know, like, hey, you know, do what you want. But like I said, the best advice is, you know, don't comment on something or, you know, uh, don't watch it either. And I think people with clickbait kind of like say, oh, you know, let's see what this is about. And then they just trash it. I'm like, I work so hard on these videos. I do this by myself. Give me some credit here. <laughs> so, yeah, so that's my advice to you guys if you're having, you know, um, a bit of uh, trouble with that. But, um, you know, and also like, um, you know, I would say cyberbullying. But I say that's kind of different. Cyberbullying is like, you know, we've had like so. When I was back at school, we I don't know if you guys had this, but when I was back at school, we had like the police uh, people come in and talk to us about cyberbullying and how that can affect you know people in general. And it's it's not like that. It's not like that. Like this is completely different to that. So just trying to give you an example of that. So yeah. So that's all I've got time for guys. Make sure to like, share, subscribe to this video, guys.